Hey guys, welcome back to Pinch and Pennies with Priscilla. I'm a little late with this video, but um, I want to come on and still do it in case um, you guys out there are able to get in on this double dip, okay? Now, Rob has put out his video this morning, and yeah, I'm just now getting around to doing my video, but I apologize for that. So hopefully you're able to still get out there. It's pretty early, so you should be able to still get in on this deal if you are just now finding out about it. So at Walgreens, the current week that we're in right now, they have the Colgate deal. This is the current week's paper right here. They have the Colgate toothbrush, which is the Max Fresh, and they have the Colgate toothpaste. Buy one, get $1,500, 1,500 points, okay? Now this is the current week that we're in, which ends today. Then the new sales ad that starts tomorrow has the exact same sales ad. Buy one for two ninety nine, get fifteen hundred points back. So if your store double dips, or I'm sorry, if your store activates their sales on Saturday, then you're able to get not only the current week's points, but you will also get tomorrow's points. Okay, so that means you'll buy one for two ninety nine, and you'll get back a total of three thousand points, which is roughly three dollars. Three dollars. So basically, even if you don't have any coupons, you're getting them for free. Now, the reason why you would want to do something like this is if you have register rewards, which have expiration dates, you always want to try to roll those register rewards into points that don't have expiration dates. So that's the main reason to do this deal. Now, if you have coupons on top of that, it is now going to become a moneymaker. Now, if you're in an area like I am that got the $1 Colgate toothpaste coupons, then you're definitely getting a great deal because you're paying um, $1.99 after your $1 coupon and you're getting back $3. That's the $2 moneymaker for each one. So, but most people... They got the 75 cents off coupon and some other people even got 35 cents off coupons. So either way, it's going to be a moneymaker for you if you have coupons. OK, so you're going to buy one of the Colgate and it seems to be on all the Colgate toothpaste, at least is on the total advanced, the total and the max fresh. And um, the two brushes are also double dipping as well because you see the Colgate toothbrush here. It is on the Max Fresh. This sales ad, same thing, is on the Max Fresh. Max Fresh is this word right here. So if you have the Colgate toothbrush coupons, you can do the double dip on that as well. This is what the Max Fresh toothbrush looks like. And you'll see it has Colgate Max Fresh right there. Those are the only two brushes it's working on. The toothpaste is working on the Max Fresh, the Total, and the Total Advance, okay? Now, I'm going to show you what I picked up in my one transaction. Um, I had some $5 register rewards from the meters that we did. I think it was, what, two weeks ago, maybe? I can't remember if it was two weeks or one week. But I had $5 register rewards from that. But some people have the $10 register rewards that they did from this week's sales with the um, diet stuff and the estrogen and the high T um, testosterone. So depending on what you got, work your deals out so that it's at your advantage. I also have an extra toothbrush here and toothpaste um, just because my daughter was with me and she picked these up. So, And I had the rewards to cover it, so I was okay with getting it. I threw in the two yogurts just to help the cashier, the yogurt bars to help the cashier out. So let me show you my receipt. And like I said, I had the $1 coupons for the toothpaste and I had a dollar off of two coupons for the toothbrush. And here's my receipt. <clears throat> and you see the two Quaker bars, the two for a dollar. The Oral-B toothpaste and toothbrush that my daughter picked up. Um, I used one dollar register rewards I had from the tea, the Lipton tea this week. So I had a lot of those. And I used... Um, Two ten dollar register rewards that I had. Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot I did um, 
a transaction prior to this where I used the, the $5 register rewards to get more of the estrogen and the diet stuff. I used those on two of those, and then I got two more register rewards, which I used on this transaction. So those are all of my coupons and my um, two $1 register rewards right here. These one dollar res these are one dollar coupons for the toothpaste and the toothbrushes. As you can see, I earned twelve thousand points for each set of four. So they gave me twelve thousand for four of the toothpaste and twelve thousand for four of the toothbrushes. My subtotal was three dollars and ten cents. I paid tax of a dollar and eighty one, and I got back twenty four thousand points right there. And yes, I have a pretty good amount of rewards because I don't use them. I've just been, like I said, I don't normally shop at Walgreens, um, Walgreens that often unless they have a double dip on points um, and a money maker. That's when I go in hard on Walgreens. And so I just save my points. I just keep doing those money maker deals. And just save my points. So yeah, I have currently 135,900 points. All right. So if you have the Colgate um, coupons, it's definitely worth doing. I mean, even if you don't have the coupons, it's still worth rolling your register rewards onto points. Okay. Always a good deal to do that. Um, so hopefully you can get out there and get in on this double dip. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Happy shopping, happy savings. Bye.